Hi, I'm Ryan Barnhart. I'm the Director of Alumni Relations. And one of my favorite parts about homecoming, when we can have it in person, is to meet alumni who maybe haven't been back for a year, 10 years, or in many cases, 50 years or more, uh, and tour them around campus. So uh, while I've never been able to achieve my dream of being a uh, National Park Service battlefield tour guide, um, I'm happy to give you my personal tour of campus today. So we're going to speed it up and hit some of the highlights of the, uh, the beauty of campus as it is in 2020 um, and you know, look at some of my favorite places here uh, today. So uh, thanks for joining us and I hope you enjoy the tour. All right, so we're here in front of Old Main and it needs no introduction. Uh, the clock tower has been restored. We're back to the future. Um, and this is definitely one of, in my opinion, the most, it is the most iconic spot on campus. Um, you know, and I think it, it symbolizes the tradition and lasting uh, impression that Cal U has left and leaves upon our alumni, students, and everybody that visits campus. So definitely one of my top favorite spots here on campus. All right, we're here at the main entrance to campus here on 3rd Street. Um, behind me, you can see the new World Cultures building, New Duda, uh, as well as the Booker Towers. Uh, and that big uh, brown building, many of you maybe <laughs> don't know what it is. That's Mandarino Library, in case you never found it during your time here on campus. But I just, uh, this is, you know, cool, the, the hangout spot, uh, prime time center uh, in terms of the, the entrance to campus. Um, so we're going to dig in a little deeper here as we motor. Okay, so this is one of my uh, favorite, like, out in the cut spots on campus. If you didn't know it was back here, you wouldn't know it's back here. Um, it is the Founders Garden. It is uh, on the back side of Old Main um, and South Hall, kind of in the cut here. But you can see um, the, you know, you got the brick here and there's like the trellis. Um, pretty cool. Uh, we got some stained glass in the back. Very quiet spot here. You know, we've got Old Main uh, right ab above us here. Um, but, uh, you know, very cool, like, hidden cow you spot back here. Um, we also have a little history. We've got the tombstone uh, of Job Johnson, one of the founders of the university and the town of California. Um, you know, so pretty cool, nice place to come and chill, you know, on, um, uh, nice days on campus. Uh, and you can see here the Founders Garden, uh, it was dedicated on June 2nd, 1996. Um, so yeah, you know, it's just a cool place to get here and chill. Um, not very utilized, I don't think, um, because it is close to the, the offices of the president and, uh, you know, it's a very quiet and reflective place, but definitely one of my favorite places on. So here on campus, you know, we uh, have since replaced all of the traditional dorms with our new residence halls, uh, but we still commemorate and, and remember the dorms of the past. We just passed uh, the new Johnson Hall, but we also have the cornerstone uh, that commemorates Johnson Hall that was er erected in 1949 and raised in 2003. Um, you know, in addition to the other halls like Vins and Longenecker. Clyde and Stanley, uh, we still do keep those traditions and memories uh, of those buildings alive, uh, and that's a really a, an important part of you know why we love to meet alumni and do these kind of tours and get their stories uh, about how how things were when they were on campus. So um, again, I'm, I'm glad you could join us on this tour. Um, we're going to keep uh, trucking on.
down here in front of the Convocation Center here on campus. Um, again, one of the coolest buildings and features I think that we have uh, here on campus. Um, you know, obviously uh, holds the newer gymnasium where we have commencement and a lot of other activities. The North and South Wings, uh, North Wings there, South Wings there, uh, have different com uh, conventions and meeting spaces and just a cool place, a great space, great staff uh, in the con uh, conference services down here um, we really enjoy it so uh, one of my favorite places this is this is a nice quiet spot down here too you know Gallagher Hall uh, the former dining hall hosts the professional golf management program and now uh, the band and uh, choir and the music department uh, we got some some dorms here uh, just a nice cool spot uh, that I really enjoy Well, thanks again for joining me today on this virtual campus tour. Uh, again, uh, we really wish we could see you safely in person this year for homecoming, uh, but we hope to be able to do that next year uh, as we celebrate our 72nd annual homecoming celebration. We hope you'll join us on campus for a lot of fun activities, good times, and a trip down memory lane. For Again, for the entire university family, I'm Ryan Barnhart, Director of Alumni Relations. Thanks for joining us.